I'd like to welcome Paddy Ward to Truck Stop TV and we're going to have a chat about his 1950 Federal with um, Ian Paul Tanker here. How are you Paddy? I'm good thanks Rob, how are you? Very good. Now we got 1950 Federal? Yeah it's a 1950 Federal style liner. It's powered by a Continental 427 cubic inch motor with a 5 speed full of gearbox and a uh, 2 speed Rockwell rear end with a single axle tanker which is uh, 10,000 litres, about 3,300 gallons back when that tanker was used, that's on the fuel game. And being a BP distributor for, for just about 35 years we decided to get into the uh, game and we found the Ampole truck. Ampole had 26 of those trucks and they're all powered by the same engine and they later repowered some of them with Cummins engines and uh, so that's, that's what it was back in the 50s. So. We got her up, it finished up being a Caldex tanker, but the truck originally was an Ampole tanker, a truck, and we had to make one truck out of two and a half trucks, and anyhow, we got it all together and it's come up really good. We we're very pleased with it. Uh, That's it, you were saying out of two and a half trucks, one of those being a Palm Olive tanker as well. Yeah, the other the other truck we got was a uh, Palm Olive Colgate, it had Palm Olive over where the Ampole is. Uh -huh. Had a cake of sabre on one door and a tube of toothpaste on the other door and we hummed and hard which way to go. And I thought being in the fuel industry we'd go the Ampole way. And Ampole being taken over by Caldex, I ring Caldex and they were very good. They give me all the uh, numbers for the paint colours and uh, that's how we went there. So uh, it came up very good. We've had it uh, about 12 years now and it's been on the road about nine years. So. Uh, we sort of bit off a little bit more than we could chew, but we got through it. Proudly presenting Australia's Transport Heritage, Vintage Trucks and Commercials magazine. At your local newsagent or order online at vtcmagazine.com.au.